Okay guys, I'm not sure where I am to be honest. Not gonna lie, not gonna fake it. I'm just walking up some cool side alley. It looks like I've been here before, but during the night time when I was just following Satnav trying to get to the train station. Um, but yeah, during the night you'll get like singers singing old school, like Spanish kind of opera, what you normally hear in Spain. <laughs> You know, I can't give it a, I can't give a demonstration because I'm not a, I'm not a singer. I don't have that voice. Okay. Churches and stuff here, or something. Wow, and yeah, that looks cool. to give you commentary on this guys <laughs> to let you know what it is but as you can see I started uh, recording before I walked up to it and uh, read it which is what most of these vloggers do <laughs> they do little quick uh, searches I mean there's nothing wrong with that but um, guys it's what it is hopefully you can read it Keep exploring. So what's going on? I'm not gonna go in. It does look cool though. It's interesting. Whoa guys, it's so hot. I'm having to wipe away my sweat every every 30 seconds. you stay hydrated when you come to these countries man you definitely need to stay hydrated don't worry about needing the toilet you can just go into one of the bars just make sure you stay hydrated man
off my chest so you guys can see but look at these old school cameras man wow I'm sure I've seen this one before these are old film cameras They look so cool, man. Wow. Funciona, man. Right? Funciona. Va todo? Todo Okay. Bueno. Ah. Eso son costoso todavía. Wow. <laughs> yeah, so the film is still expensive. Um, I don't know, it just costs a lot to get produced. But for vintage photography, I mean, you're winning, you're winning. Like in the sense, they all work, so, you know, look at this. It's tiny, it reminds me of something out of Jane Bond, the old, the 1980s ones, I think. But yeah. Wow. Oh, man, so hot. Okay, I have no idea where I am. But I'm exploring still. Apparently there's a prime mark around here. I'm not sure where. But we're gonna try and find out, okay? We're gonna try and find out where this prime mark is. I might buy a beach towel. I think I should buy a beach towel. And I wanna buy um, just a very cheap rucksack as well now the reason for that is i don't want to take my main rucksack or backpack to the beach and something go terribly wrong because <laughs> that that backpack was like over 80 pounds so it was an expensive bag for a reason because it's quality it's quality okay so that is going to be part of the mission i am actually gonna um look for primark probably probably buy the cheapest rucksack going so I can, and a beach towel so I can get all of that to fit inside the bag, okay? Anyway guys, not sure what this building is. Definitely well known, but not by me. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a terrible tourist. I'm more of a street walker. 
I don't always actually head out to the tourist destinations per se I might go to the tourist destinations in terms of the streets and um, stuff like that but not actually sites like museums and stuff I don't really find museums that interesting apart from stuff like like a car motor museum motorbike museum maybe um, uh, aviation museum like for planes that kind of stuff or photography technology that kind of stuff so um, let me keep looking all right and look for this primer Now it's just not helpful. Google, Google is not helpful in Spain. It's just not. But it is to a point. Let me not lie. It is helpful to a point. But then the maps are going crazy. Like you're walking in the direction that it tells you to go in, and then halfway there, it flips around and starts pointing you the opposite way. Like, come on, man. come on. Gotta do better. All right, let's see. Let's see. 